Hello everyone, this is Dr. Juwan. If you're new to my channel, thank you very much. I always appreciate newbies. Please subscribe, hit the bell notification, hit the like button, and also in addition, leave a comment. Now I do answer the comments, and if you have a lot of questions, I always encourage, follow my web link down below here, schedule me for a one-on-one -on -one appointment. If you live in the area, please come on in. I do Zoom calls, I do regular calls, I do any type of calls that will allow me to help you get better health. So thanks for watching. Hello everyone, this is Dr. Juwan. In this video, I want to talk about a powerful supplement called natokinase. And natokinase has been around for a long time. It's nature's natural blood thinner. It's referred to as a proteolytic enzyme. What that does, it eats or dissolves any proteins in the body that do not serve a healthy purpose. Now, with taking natokinase, it helps with the managing of arterial plaque buildup. It's a powerful anti-inflammatory it has fibrin degrading activities. Now, what is fibrin? Fibrin is a tough protein which is essential for blood clotting. So when we hit ourselves or if we have internal arterial damage, what that is, that's fibrin. And if it gets too big, what happens? It causes a clot or a plug. So this decreases the, plot, the clots in the plaque and also in addition to reinforces the action of plasma. Now, plasmin is needed, so it's our body's own mechanism breaking down fibrin. However, this kind of boosts the plasmin activities or mechanisms. So it actually de decreases the buildup of plaque even greater. So what is it? It's an enzyme extracted and purified from a Japanese food called natto or natto, either either. I don't want any comments down below. It's this. And it's produced from fermented soybeans. So the soybeans are fermented with adding the bacteria bacillus natto. So this produces the protease, the protease enzymes, which is the most important part of natokinase. So that's how it's made. Our body has a balanced system. It has clotting factors and anti-clotting factors. So when you have damaged tissue, whether it be a punch to the arm or internal damage to the arterial arteries, now the arteries have that inner lining wall called the endothelium and it needs to be smooth, like a smooth hose, like a brand new hose. Damaged tissue creates scars. Now that scar, is made from fibrin and like fibrin is like a mesh material and it's great for clotting it's great for wound healing however too much fibrin buildup if you have too much scar tissue buildup what's going to happen it's going to impair blood flow because that hose is going to become narrowed which leads to increased blood viscosity blood viscosity that's a thickness so now your arteries is going to be th the blood going through there is going to be a lot thicker which leads to swelling, pain, and edema, and of course, increased stress on the cardiovascular system because the heart, that's your pump. Which means that the thicker the blood is, the harder the cardiovascular system has to work, and now you have increased inflammation. Increased inflammation, why? Because you have increased plaque buildup. Okay, so now what are the benefits of taking natokinase? Now you know what it is, how it works. The benefits are amazing because one, it prevents and dissolves blood clots. In addition, it promotes a healthy cardiovascular system. It helps maintain healthy CRP levels. Now, what CRP levels? And when you take blood labs, that is C-reactive protein. That's an indicator of inflammation within the system. In addition, it's neuroprotective. It helps with cholesterol. Cholesterol is the, one of the indicators of the, it's the arterial band-aid. Arthrosclerosis, arthrosclerosis, those not the little tiny arteries, but the big ones, and the big ones like the abdominal aorta, that helps reduce that sclerosis that's built up in your big hose. In addition, it's great for stroke prevention, Alzheimer's disease. Now, one of the things that NATO has, which is extremely beneficial to, by taking it, it has high amounts of vitamin K2. Not K1, vitamin K2, because what does K2 do? K2 is one of the vitamins that helps remove the protein of, I'm sorry, the, the calcium buildup in the arteries and shunts it into the bones where it should go. In addition, because we need, we need good amounts of vitamin K2 and magnesium, it's important for regulating the calcium within the body. So of course, what's the, que the question is dosing. How do I dose this? And by the way, yes, you, there's no long-term harmful effects noted because remember, this is from food. It's a Japanese food 
that they've been using for centuries. So there's, you don't need an on time or an off time. Some people ask about cycling supplements. Now the dosing, you always want to take an empty stomach because it is going to dissolve the fibrin. I always recommend 100 milligrams, which equates to 2000 FUs. <laughs> yeah, FUs. Fibrin units. And you want to do it up to two to three times a day, depending on your condition. So then what are the contraindications? Who should not be taking NATO kinase? Now remember what this is, it's nature's natural blood thinner. Anyone who has a peptic ulcer, if you have coagulation disorders, if you're on anticoagulants, and of course, pre and post surgery, do not take this. All right, so I hope this helps. Remember, please, uh, please subscribe, bell notification, like, and leave a comment. Have a good day, I'll see you in the next one.